Hey guys and welcome back to a new video on this channel. So today I'm talking about an update to the Ultimate Web Novel and Manga Scraper plugin. So it got an update and a rule paging was added to it. So this was not available until now, but uh, because of popular requests, I added this feature to the plugin. So you will see that if you create multiple rules. So let me show you this feature. So if we create multiple importing rules here in the plugin, we can also create with the same name. The plugin will paginate the rules and not show all the importing rules and campaigns on a single page. So this is very helpful, especially if you have slower computers and uh, you will be able to change the number of uh, rules that the plugin will display here. So just click on the first page and the rules will be displayed like this. So let's create multiple rules here. Okay, and you will see that if you create more than 10, if you set the rules per page, the paging will jump to two and you can check the previous page here. This will be the 10 importing rules and the next page like this. And if you increase the rules per page count here, you will see that if you click on first page, all the rules will be displayed like this. And if we also decrease this to five, multiple pages will be created. So click on next page, next page, and so on you will be able to create new rules on the last page of the results. So yeah, this is the latest update. If you haven't heard of the Ultimate Manga Scraper and Web Novel Scraper, click on the link from this video description and go check it. It is a cool scraper if you want to create manga sites or web novel sites. Also, it has this new pagination feature for their rules and it is really useful. So if you have more ideas of updates for this plugin or other plugins I created, let me know in the comment section of this video and I will check them. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.